What is good, guys? It's your boy, Cree! Happy Friday. Hope everybody had a great week, but we got a fire field mail day. Let's get into it. All right, guys, I'm gonna be showing you guys a bunch of seal product that I've been collecting over, I guess, the weeks or whatever, however you guys wanna say it. But first, I have a giveaway. Of course, I'm gonna be giving away a Fist of the Gadget pack to one of you guys. I want you guys to open up some packs for yourself. And Fist of the Gadget is, you know how they keep giving me Fist of the Gadget packs. So I thought I'd give you guys one. So all you gotta do is like the video, subscribe to the channel, and let me know what kind of packs you wanna see open on the channel. I do wanna branch off and open up a lot more stuff. So let me know what kind of stuff you guys want me to open. And also let me know what your favorite seal product is in this video that's pretty much it all right guys this is pretty sick the first thing i bought these are turbo pack seven packs these are actually not really open that much on youtube i haven't seen many people open them besides when it first came out that's just not that much i mean there's not really that cool of a chase card i would think but i mean like you know opening packs you want to just try and chase stuff regardless of what it is you know like not uh, super expensive stuff but with turbo packs there's actually only one ulti and one ultra in the entire set so i think that makes it a lot more cooler you know just in general so these aren't that expensive so i just thought i'd start small but i do want to start opening up all the turbo packs i think it'd be way funner to try and get like the only ulti in the set so i actually got like 20 of these so this will be a crazy video in the future to try and open and try and find i think uh it's um cat 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 store is the ulti in here and that used to be a monster like back in the day like destroying like i think if it wasn't a dark monster or something it just destroyed it before damage count so yeah that's pretty sick so i got 20 of these hopefully it taps it in here and it would be super epic to pull that or the ultra rare because like i said there's only one ultra and one ulti in the entire set so that would be pretty sweet all right next guys this one's epic i had to do it you guys know i had to get me a first edition booster box of judgment of the light this is super epic this is probably one of my favorite zexel sets and i'm trying to get a lot more zexel stuff because i feel like zexel is one of the better eras like after i guess the og era it's like really cool and i think it's really slept on era really cool so i yeah like i said this is one of my favorite sets in zexel so i definitely had to get me a first edition booster box so this is definitely gonna go in my collection probably gonna get one of the um the booster box protectors whatever you call them but yeah this is really cool first edition it's really sick and i think i got it at a good price but yeah it's pretty sweet got next this is gonna be super epic supposed to have gotten well we're waiting it's probably pretty sweet it's supposed to be like an entire oh wait oh wait this is this is supposed to be an entire special edition uh here it is an entire special edition of Shadow Spectres. You got a whole, if you guys can see it in the camera, entire special edition. I got this for, uh, I think I got it for a good price, but like I said, I do want to start getting more Zexal stuff, guys, and this is it. Shadow Spectres, pretty cool set. I mean, like, it's kind of like the Halloween set that ever opens during Halloween, but yeah, I'm just trying to collect a lot more Yu-Gi-Oh! older stuff, and like, the Zexal stuff is getting pretty cool, so that's pretty sweet. And the piece the resistance this we got a samurai's assault field special edition guys and these are crazy expensive for a full like special edition sealed like each mini box is going for like 50 bucks by itself and uh, if you guys do not know why it's actually because they have some very old packs they got strike of neos which is like even unlimited like the prices for like 30 plus just for one pack Crimson Crisis is going up there in price, and they got Storm Ragnarok. I think the special edition is going to like 30 for a box. Yeah, so you guys can see why this would be as expensive as it is, but it is really cool. I got a seal. I haven't even seen a sealed like box of this in a while. I've only seen like the actual mini boxes. I think Yugi Mo opens these up every now and again, but this is really cool, really epic. Like I guess set that they put together with three packs, like three like super cool epic packs, especially with the Strike of Neo. So that's really fire. So I don't know what I'm gonna open this. So I'm gonna keep this sealed for a while. 
probably open this later down the line, but it's really cool. All right, guys, that's gonna do it for the collection, but you know, we gotta end it with some packs. So I got three Legendary Duels Razor Raw. If you follow me on Instagram, I found these and I actually got one for the wall, which is pretty sick. If you guys can see behind me, it is getting really big and I love it so much. So we're gonna open up some of these. Let me know how much you guys think all that stuff was for my seal collection. It's really cool. I got a bunch of cool stuff and I'm really excited. I'm gonna keep adding to it. Probably gonna try and get some more turbo packs. I know like the other turbo packs, they got some expensive stuff in there. But like I said, I really like the chase of just trying to pull like the only ulti or ultra in the set, you know? It's a lot better than just like there being five ultis and stuff. They still are crazy expensive, of course, for the new OTS sets, but you know, there's something about it being only one that makes it a little bit more fun. So we're gonna actually take out all of these Rage of Raw. Like these are going for like 20 bucks of blister, if not more now. It's crazy. Like what, this is the first, I think it's the first set to where they yeah, brought back the Ghost Rares with the Winged Dragon of Raw. So can we pull the Winged Dragon of Raw in this video? That'd be crazy. So uh, yeah, let's actually try and do it. We got six packs. Nah, yeah, it's, I don't know how short print, uh, it might be like normal, just like 288, like a case type thing. Reboot, Meta Reflect Sign, Amplifier, and you got Jinzo Returner and the Rare Mound of Bound Creep. All right, cool. All right, let's go. Let's see if we can pull, or we can just get like a holler. This is something fire. We got six packs, you know? Reboot, Jinzo Lord, Jinzo, and we got a... Jirai Guido, Everlasting Aloe. Four pack. Yeah, I don't, I don't think I opened that much of these. I th actually think I opened a lot now that I think about it. I think we were really trying to hunt for that Ghost Air Raw. It was like really hard to pull. I still have not pulled it yet. It's really crazy. The Resolute Mechlord Army, Mechlord Fortress, Jinzo Ejector, Token Sunday. All right, come on, let's get, let's get a hollow. What's that? A three pack star right now? Let's just see if we can get a hollow. That would be cool. All right, we got holding arm. Oop, I almost, I almost skipped to it. Mech Lord, Emperor Granel, and a Resolute Mech Lord Army. You know, these are not being kind to me at all. Let's just end it with the hollow. That's all you want. Let's go. Yeah, I'm not trying to bend the card. All right, let's go. We got Psychic Shockwave, Mechlord Army of Skill, Jinzo Lord, come on, let's get a hollow. Bro, Jirahito, Mound the Bound Creator. All right, last pack. These blisters are terrible to us. They did not even get a hollow. Can we end it with a hollow? Yes! Okay, we got an Ultra Rare Guardian Flying too. That's pretty cool. I think it's worth a couple bucks. This used to be like $10 when it first came out too, but now it went down some, but we still got a hollow, so that is great. Right. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to like, subscribe. Let me know how much you think I paid for my steel collection. Let me know your favorite piece of steel product that you saw today. That's pretty much it. This is Creed, I'm out.